Here are four new coins on KuCoin. Gari Network, a short form video platform like TikTok, but powered by crypto. Mojito Swap, a decentralized exchange on the KCC network. RankerDAO, a gaming guild focused on investing in play to earn games. AlphaDex, aiming to bring decentralized finance to the Polkadot ecosystem through Moon River. But first, the disclaimer. None of this is financial advice. This is not an endorsement for any of these coins. This is just going to teach you about what they are, what you can do with it, and just some very casual information. If you do want to invest, please do your own research to the point where you can form your own opinion. And when you are ready to invest, these coins and many more are available on KuCoin. There will be a referral link in the description that will get you 20% off your trades. Now, let's explore crypto gems on KuCoin. Number one, Gari Network. Coin name, Gari. TikTok, you love it or you hate it or you love that you hate it or you hate that you love it. A lot of things, but it is one of the most time-consuming apps even for myself. There is a lot of content on there, but the problem is if you are a content creator, you don't make any money off it. You get a very small amount of income compared to other platforms. And another problem, you, the viewer, besides being entertained, you don't get rewarded for it. So Gari Network is flipping things and uh, changing that up. So creators can be rewarded for their content more. They can create NFTs, they can accept tips. All of this happens with crypto. And for you, the viewer, you can be rewarded. So with Gari Network, they have watch to earn, engage to earn, and play to earn. So you, the viewer, the person participating on the platform can be rewarded for your time while also being entertained. So imagine instead of sitting through ads, you get rewarded for it. That is what Gari Network is doing. And we can take a look in the Chingari app. You have a built-in non-custodial wallet to hold your Gari coin. Their governance token Gari will also be used as an in-app currency in the future. Users will be able to deposit and withdraw their Gari coins from the Chingari app to the Gari wallet or to any other non-custodial Solana based wallet. That means a wallet you are in charge of and not directly on an exchange or a crypto exchange that supports the Gari coin on the Solana network. Users can also use their Gari tokens in their wallet to tip their favorite content creators directly from the feed as well as from the creator's profile. These transactions are completely on chain. The transactions happen on the Solana blockchain, which is almost instant. Shingari bears the gas fee required for the on-chain transactions transactions, so users don't need to worry about that. There is no cost for you to send crypto on the Chingari platform. However, there will be a management fee charged per transaction to facilitate further development and support the Gari DAO treasury. If you want to be a creator on their platform, you can use Gari tokens to boost your profile or videos. And similar to platforms like Patreon, you can create a membership or even paid content. So if you create paid content, someone's going to have to pay to access that content. This is their roadmap. They have a lot happening in Q1 of 2022 and more later this year. Let us know in the comments if you will be participating on the Gari network or your experiences with it. Or if you've been using the platform already, let us know what you think of it. Number two, Mojito Swap. Coin name MJT. If you don't know what a mojito is, it is a beverage. So it's kind of like swapping beverages, which is not a great thing during a time of COVID. But if you're just talking about decentralized finance, it is a lot better since you don't get sick. So Mojito Swap is a decentralized exchange and automatic market maker, and you can do some farming. And this is all done on the KCC network. It is a smart contract platform similar to Ethereum, but powered by the KCS token. That's the KuCoin official coin, uh, the KCS coin, KuCoin coin. It sounds like a lot of words there, but if you've used the KuCoin platform, the official platform token is the KCS coin. And that's what's also used to power transactions on this network. So with DeFi on Ethereum, you need Ethereum to fund those transactions. Same thing for the KCC network. You need KCS to fund your transactions on this network. And since Mojito Swap is a decentralized exchange, that means you don't need to create an account. You don't need to provide an email address or password. You just need to connect your wallet. And within Mojito Swap, there is a lot of things you can do. You can trade coins on the KCC network. 
Uh, that's the exchange side. You can add liquidity that allows you to earn based on the people trading within that trading pair. You can bridge assets to the KCC network. It links you to the KCC.io bridge. So you can move coins from Ethereum to the KCC network from a lot of other chains. And then you have the bar. So that's what they call it, but it's pretty much the farm. You have these trading pairs, for example, MJT and KCS. If you add liquidity to it, you'd be able to deposit your LP tokens and earn even more interest for staking them on the platform. So bar, think of that as the farm. And then there's wine pools, which allows you to stake your MJT. There is manual and auto mode. Manual gets you APR, where your rewards are not automatically reinvested. And auto means those rewards are automatically reinvested for you. That is APY. Then there's referral, so you get rewards for referring friends. And then there's shaker, they call it trade mining. So whenever you trade between these pairs, you will earn MJT tokens. So if you make a trade between MJT and KCS, you earn some MJT. You make a trade between KCS and ETH, you get some MJT. So they do have this shaker trade mining feature. They have an NFT marketplace on the way, and they also have a launch pad available. Number three, Ranker DAO. Coin name, Ranker. Ranker DAO is a community centered around play to earn games with the goal to help members in the community succeed. If you're like me, mastering a game can be hard, or it could be, I don't have the time required to get good enough, or it might be, because learning a new game with new controls, mechanics, and gameplay can be confusing, or it just might be, as I get older, I'm just really bad at video games. I don't have the time, commitment, or drive to actually get good at them anymore. Lots of games are all about strategy, and if you don't know it, the chances you'll succeed are lower. With more play-to-earn games coming out, it really pays to be ahead of the curve more than ever, and that's what RankerDAO wants to solve. RankerDAO has its own native token, Ranker. You can buy Ranker tokens on KuCoin, and then use them to mint your guild badge and unlock access to the DAO. Currently, guild members can choose between two of the biggest P2E games, Axie Infinity and Thetan Arena. The DAO is where you can socialize with other members in your guild. Once in a guild, members can strategize and come up with the most effective ways to earn in the games. You can even create your own team within the guild, and that's a lot better than going solo because you have a passionate and experienced team rather than a bunch of random. Guilds also spar against other guilds in games and can be rewarded with ranker. If you need further help, level up your badge and take part in coaching sessions. A skilled player in your game of choice will show you the ropes to help you improve your gameplay. As they grow, they want to implement more social fi features as in in-house tournaments and allow members to vote on where to expand. For instance, be it metaverses, sport NFTs, works of art, etc. Let me know in the comments what you think of RankerDAO and what games you're interested in playing in the comments. Number 4. Alpha Dex. Coin name, Roar. What is it and why should you care? The first thing to note is Alpha Dex is a fully operational decentralized exchange and automatic market maker, AMM, that has already been integrated into Moon River and Ethereum blockchains. It's rare to see a project of this scale launch in this state. Moon River is the EVM compatible chain that acts as a companion chain to the Moonbeam network. What that means is Moon River acts like a test chain for Moonbeam. A lot of code gets tested on Moon River first before getting passed to Moonbeam. This is similar to how other chains like Kusama act on the Polkadot network. And if you didn't already know, Moonbeam won the first round of parachain auctions on Polkadot, which is a pretty big deal. AlphaDex uses its own native token called Roar. When you purchase and hold Roar, you receive the best staking and farming rewards possible. The user interface is easy to navigate. Holding Roar gives you first options for top tier launchpad projects via their Savannah launchpad, which launched ahead of schedule. Savannah holds their fair launches to ensure a quality user experience. Alphadex uses the Savannah Launchpad to provide access to projects that launch on Moon River, Moonbeam, Kusama, and Polkadot. This is their roadmap for 2022. Those were four new coins listed on KuCoin. Let us know in the comments what you think or about any types of videos you'd like to see in the future. And if you want to get started using KuCoin, there is a referral link for 20% off your trades in the description. And lastly, while you're still here, check out some more great videos on the KuCoin channel. This has been a KuCoin video.